What up, what up, Iku? Welcome back to the channel. We're here in, in our my favorite local mountain bike trail, Turnbull Canyon. And there's just the three of us here, e-bikers, all mid-drives. I have my Santa Cruz BBSHD build, 52 volt with Luna Volt battery. Mark has his Narika bike. And Tom up ahead also has his BBS HD bike. And we're just climbing up. Just the three of us. Cloudy day. Might drizzle a little bit, but should be a fun one. How's the torque sensor? <laughs> I love the throttle. Yeah. What's what's the peak for that one? What? Yeah. A thousand. A thousand. Yeah. Okay. I, I I don't know on the website it says fifteen hundred, but I don't know. Okay, so it's like a BBS HD. Uh, Inside. What's that? Oh, the Baffling Ultra. Yeah. Got it. Got it. It is louder. Yeah. Um, I'm pretty sure it is stronger. Typically, louder motors are stronger. Typically. Yeah. As long as it doesn't rain on us, because it does look like it's uh, moist. It's a possibility that it could rain. All right, we're gonna put the Narika to test. Climbing on up one of the steepest part of this ride. Entering the off-roading time. All right, just follow Tom. He's gonna be climbing up that thing right there. Nice. Most people struggle right here, in this area, right about here. Oh! Oh yeah, he's gone. All right, Baffling Ultra. Did you fall, Mark? What? Did you fall? Yeah. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. I kind of lost my foot. No, because you're, you're back. Oh, because you fell on the, when yeah. take a picture. I was like. <laughs> what was that? I remember now. <laughs> All right, here we go. So you made that. That was good. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, there's weeds just grew up. So much weeds now. Uh, Narika passed the first test today, which is that steep grade. Nothing technical. Just enjoy the scene, scenery. Phew, here we go. I was telling the guys that we're gonna go to Borrego Springs soon. Looking at some um, more astrophotography and uh, with the galvanized sculptures. Very cool today. All right, roller coaster time. <laughs> roller coaster time. <laughs> Woohoo! <laughs> Oh, it's fun. So cold and so fun. Hey, Mark is not standing up at all, huh? And that's a hard tail, Narika. I recommend you stand up, Mark. Hell. Do you want to try standing up sometime or no? <laughs> like, like when you're scouting stance, uh -huh. that way your your body's not absorb absorbing. Oh yeah, 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 yeah. Yeah. So it's a little more downhill, but okay. right, how, how whatever you're more comfortable with. <laughs> yeah, if it's a little bit bouncy. I usually stand up. A little oh, okay, okay. It's it's more comfortable, right? <laughs> when you when you stand. Yeah, it doesn't have that. Alrighty, later later for sure you're gonna stand. <laughs> 
we go. Onwards to Whittier area. More downhill. I take that back. It was like 98 degrees two days ago. And now it's like 60s. I don't know what's going on with the world. actually less scenic with so much weeds um, interrupting your, your view. It feels like. It feels like a really uh, different ride. Whew. <laughs> How was that? It's <laughs> fun, right? Pretty. Very pretty. Yeah. A little bit technical, but it really flow more flowy than technical. I'll follow you guys. Like if you, you guys, you know, go at whatever speed. Oh no, like, no, we we don't. We rush. Yeah, we don't rush. yeah, we don't rush you. Yeah, yeah. I'll lead because I have a horn. Okay. Because of our blind spots, but we're again we're gonna. Oh, Julian. Oh, like the cowbell. Yeah. You you're okay leading? It's up to you. If you want me to, I do it. Unless you really want to, you usually want me to. So. Yeah, sure. Cause I I could I could uh, I could sweep. I like to sweep. <laughs> no, this is tight. <laughs> Look at all the weeds here. We're getting whacked. <laughs> Holy smokes. <laughs> We're going to get brushed by the end of this ride. We're going to be all yellowed out. This reminds me of Chino Hills. Ah, weed whack time. Well, I wore my gloves at the right time. Uh oh. Whew. Yeah, buddy. But we keep it easy. We keep it beginner. Narika bikes performing fine here. Nice, Mark. What a view, guys. What a view. Berm turn. Ew. So there's a switch back and then an uphill. Okay. Right about where Tom's going to be. <laughs> That's not too bad, actually. Oh, too bad the first time. Now it's uphill. Let's get it. So it's gonna be a bumpy uphill for about five minutes. That tire is uh, doing good. Good gripping. It's got torque sensor. I'm on PA6, getting some work out here. Let's go to PS8 because it's about to get super steep. Oh, Mark's over there. Got it, Mark. Oh, Mark got it through that. Nice. That's one of the first time that someone got through this steep hill on their first try. Nice work. My turn. Whew. Nice. You made that one, huh? Yeah, you made it easily. You know, we're probably the first one that you made it in the first try. Oh. That's the hardest part. My photo did it. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> More downhill. 
and uh, trying to avoid the ruts around here. But Mark's doing just fine. We lowered his tire pressure, lowered his seat, so that way he'll be just okay. Yeah, the only thing is to watch out for these stupid ruts. Ruts! Big ruts! <laughs> Don't want to get stuck in him. That's how you would lose your balance. <laughs> oh, choose the outside line. And we're out in the open. One thing I haven't done is shown the bike that I'm using today. And we'll do that now. We like to brief here because uh, um, check everything. Your axles are good because uh, uh, there's r uh, rollers or jumps now, like about nine of them. If you want it, you could you could roll on it, or you could fly off of it. Yeah. <laughs> First time, I always scout it out. Um, but yeah, I'm just gonna check on my equipment. Yeah, battery is good, chain ring good. But yeah, this is the ride today. Santa Cruz frame, 26er. All right, it's time to fly. <laughs> Here we go. Practice the bunny hops. Let's go. You. Uh oh. <laughs> no one's behind me. And I don't take this log. This log is too abrupt. Ruins this jump. Woohoo! Ah, uh, no one's behind me. <laughs> Rider. Two more behind. <laughs> so fun here, guys. Oh, oh I landed uh, all squirrely and uh, without a straight. Yeah, buddy. Whew. I'm awake again, guys. That hill always wakes me up. That freeway, so-called freeway. These bikes are amazing. How was that? Oh, it's fun. Right? <laughs> Did you get any air? A little bit. There you go. Yeah, but Sweet. Not <laughs> crazy. Yeah. Yeah, fun, right? Because that's the first time. Yeah, that's, that's the first crazy. time, yeah. Now, uh, so the more you get it, the more air you get. So, <laughs> okay, I, I think I know how. Just press and hold. All right, here he goes, the uh, torque. I'm in the Rinderica. Torque sensor versus cadence sensor. And there's, there's Mark using my bike, and I'm the Narika going up. Yeah, so the, the difference obviously with torque sensor bikes like this, one, they're more expensive, and two, the harder you pedal, the more your motor helps you. Versus that bike, the BBS HD, is always just an on and off switch, kind of. I couldn't hear you. Oh yeah, it's good. It is more workout. Yeah. But your seat is actually comfortable for yeah for being at a, a hardtail. Your seat is actually comfortable. You see how Tom's jumping? And this bike is actually heavy to jump off of. <laughs> That was a workout. <laughs> what is your um, take? Uh, Easier, right? Yeah, yeah. Easier, yeah. This is the hell no, the hospital jump. Woo. Yes, sir. Super high. 
guy. Oh, that was nice. That was super high. Damn, man. Have fun in this one, probably the last one. Okay. Jump that Tom. Oh my gosh, people are going so fast. Ew. <laughs> Mark almost lost balance. Oh, yo, Tom's getting some crazy air. You boom shakalaka. Nice, Tom. You. Yes, sir. Yeah, buddy. <laughs> you have good timing. Good recovery. Good recovery. <laughs> that that means you're doing something different, uh -huh. and then you're pushing it. You know, like that's the that's the good stuff there. What what type of frame did they say it is? It's aluminum, right? No, it's a carbon. It's carbon. Yeah. But it felt so heavy. I know, yeah, I think the, wheels. the wheels. The wheels, the battery, the motor. Okay. Yeah. yeah. You, your motor definitely disturbs the peace. Uh, motor what? <laughs> your loud motor? Complaining. <laughs> it definitely sounds like an e-bike, you know? Sure. Climbing on up here. Going to the water tower. To break for sunset views. Okay, try it. Try it here. We'll go to like PS. <laughs> well, that's where you break. Whoa. <laughs> you tried it. I didn't think you were going to try it. You modulate your your rear brake when you when you feel like you're about to loop. I'm not really too willing anyway. Fun. Yeah, we take it downhill sometimes. Okay. It's doable. I think going up was hard because um, it's too it's too much ruts. Yeah. I didn't get enough grip. Almost there. Almost on top of the world again. Our final stop. And then we're heading back. But look at that, guys. Hello. Follow that guy. Yeah. Hook left. And then uh, we'll stop where Tom is going to be here on the left side. Watch. Well, the good thing is everything is going to be downhill from here on out. Okay. Yeah. You want to lean back, equal braking, and just look for a good rut. I mean, I, <laughs> avoid the rut. <laughs> this line here. Yes, sir. As soon as I took my tires, I'm all good. As soon as I popped in my thicker rear tires, I'm gripping a lot better. Really nice cloudy day today. Makes, the, makes it more dramatic, in my opinion. We're gonna head out. I'm gonna do some dinner, catch up with Crystal, and watch a movie. Probably Sonic's. Sonic 2. Nice, buddy. Nice work. <laughs> Everyone's sliding on the same spot there. All right, good stuff. Oh, that was fun. <laughs> <laughs> we out of here. There's a drop out on the left. You don't have to take it. <laughs> Getting pretty dark. Really chilly. City lights starting to turn on. But Narika bike went just fine. There's some hills, you know, for first timers, he did really well. But now it's time for like some speed, some downhill speed. Freaking Tom is gone. 
Tom ride, rides a, a motorbike, a super bike, super motorbike. It's only natural he, he wants to go fast down these hills. <laughs> yeah, buddy. Alright, folks. We're almost out of here. I'm going to cut the video. Thank you for sticking around and tuning in. Help the channel by liking and subscribing and checking out the useful links in the description below if you're shopping for an e-bike. I recommend a DIY bathing kit because it's a great all-around tool mid-drive for climbing. It's just a great all-around tool, these mid-drive bathing kits. And you save money. Really good for your value. Anyhow, you know what else is good for your value? Is an aerial rider. Definitely best bang for your buck for what it offers on e-bikes. If not, a Super 73 S2. For that looks, aesthetic looks, and for that community and lifestyle. All right, folks, we out. Tom is trying to race the uh, the other road bike road cyclist. It's like I was just sh showboating everyone here. Anyhow, another amazing e-bike ride in the books. Stay tuned for more content. See you guys in the next ride. Peace.